Right now, businesses in downtown Whitewater are recovering after a fire Saturday. It happened on Center Street and spread to two buildings. Grace Hodek spoke to one business owner impacted as you covered on why she says there's finally relief after such a traumatic moment. It's a phone call no one ever wants to receive. So that the building was on fire and that they were being evacuated. Natalie Serna owns Barista Cat's Cafe in downtown Whitewater. And right now she's cleaning up after a fire damaged her business. It was a very traumatic and terrifying experience for everybody. It's really hard for a business owner when you, a small business owner especially, when you're investing your own money, um, grants and funding and to watch it go. But she tells me her concerns go beyond the bricks of the building. One of the cafe's cats went missing. We weren't sure if she was here or if she was out. My gut told me she was here, but in chaos like that, you really can't guarantee that they didn't slip out the back door. After three long days of searching and sleepless nights, Serna says there was a moment of relief. We're watching the cameras just to be sure. We had a wonderful community member come down from the college with a thermal camera. A glimpse of the cat escaping into the ceiling. It's just overwhelming sense of, you know, just happiness that she's good and she's here. And she's probably going to be a little bit traumatized when she comes down and it's going to take a lot more work once she is down, but I'm okay with that because she's my doll. There's an emotional journey ahead for everyone, but with some helping hands and paws, she will reopen again. The building was mostly damaged by smoke. Serna tells me they hope to reopen on Wednesday, but says it all depends on how the cats are doing. There's a GoFundMe set up to recover from damages and losses. A link to that will be on our website, WKOW.com.